Hello and welcome to Is It a Good Idea to Microwave This? I'm your host, Jory Karen. And I'm your sidekick, Brandon McKellen. Today, we will be microwaving this silly putty. It bounces like rubber. What? It stretches like taffy. What? And all that in a convenient microwave. Oh. So, wow, we're gonna stick you in the microwave. All hands to the deck. Nobody oh. likes roasted nuts. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Ventilation is key. What are you doing? Put that out! Does this still work? You're dumb. The masks, they do nothing. Nothing, stop it. Can I get the fire extinguisher? No. Two point five. Is it a good idea to microwave this? Let's find out. Here at the Jory Karen Laboratory, safety is our number one concern. And that's why we hide behind oh. this tinfoil shield. Dude, you're already grossing me out. We haven't even started yet. What are you talking about? <laughs> The nasty. bigger the waistband, the quicker the quicksand. Get it? No. It's no. Not it, the tinfoil shields protect our nuts because nobody likes roasted oh. nuts. <laughs> oh, you, oh, oh, you got it. We have this fan to circulate the air, and as always, our GE turntable microwave oven. Her name is Jackie, and without her, is anything really possible? I don't think so. Well, we'd have to get another microwave, but yeah, I understand. <laughs> Let's go ahead and uh, put this silly string there. Let's put one inside this little plastic egg. Yeah. Okay, it goes right there. So I wonder how long you should put it in there for. Uh, I'm going to say uh, 342. Sounds good to me, brother. Let's get out of here. Um, I see sparking, but that can't be the silly putty because that doesn't make any sense. You know, you just stay out of this, okay? You don't know the love that Jackie has for silly putty. I, I think really the smell is going to be worse than anything. You, you think, think silly so? putty? Well, I what mean... do you think it's made of? Oh, oh. I mean, shit, what could that be? Oh my god. That looks dangerous. Do you think that could be... Well, whatever it was, it just stopped. No, I don't think it did. I, I think can't. that's probably the actual microwave doing that. What? That doesn't make any sense. Maybe we should cut it now and see what's going on. Ooh. Okay, let's go in there. What did I tell you about the smell? This could be deadly. Where's your mask, John? John, where's your mask? I forgot to put it on! Damn it! <laughs> Damn it, John! Yeah, the glass is broken. But Another plate broken? Wow, we are really going to town on this stuff. Is it hard? It's still pretty much the same consistency. Really? Yeah. Can I, can I see? It just seems a little warmer. It's not really any different, actually. Oh, I wonder how that happens. It looks like you fused it together with the, the silly putty is like holding it together. Oh, no, not anymore. <laughs> We've destroyed two plates. That's a first for any season on this show. Uh, <laughs> I've never heard that noise before. Well, you've never played around with microwaves then. <laughs> <laughs> you may be thinking, is it a good idea to microwave silly putty? Absolutely, because every kid deserves a solid lump of silly putty, not just like all strung out. You put it in there, and the red one actually seemed to have uh, kind of uh, taken the shape of the egg a little bit more than when I put it in there, because when I put it in there, it was all stringy and stuff. So yeah, give the children what they deserve, untainted silly putty. And that's a good idea right there. That's about it for Is It A Good Idea to Microwave This. I'm your host, Jory Carrigan.